Welcome to Wendy Hill Kennel. Today is the last day of February. Tomorrow is March the 1st. So if you're viewing us for the first time, we are in Central Ohio and we do schnauzers and schnoodles. Uh, we kind of specialize more in schnoodles than we do schnauzers, but um, we're doing a few litters of schnauzers for you schnauzer folks this year, but mostly we do schnoodles and you've all turned around the other way. Um, if you go down below the video, if you're watching this on YouTube, you will see that um, you can subscribe to our channel. And if you do, we will notify you every time by email that we have a new video up. Um, we do videos every week, um, never guaranteed Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, sometime between Monday and Saturday. You just are everywhere. We do videos. Uh, what else can I throw at you? If you're seeing this on YouTube, please don't call me and ask me if a puppy's available. If you go to our website, you can see on that litter if it's available or not. I get so many calls and people always call me after they're all sold. So if you're looking for a puppy that you're seeing on a video, please check the website. We have an expected litter page and we have a puppies for sale page and we have a puppies that are sold page. So that way you'll know what we have available. Um, so we have Winnie's little kids down here today. I know it's just a cute babies. Winnie is a little seven and a half pound toy schnauzer and she has four little tiny kids. Goodness, you guys are everywhere. Um, we have two girls, two boys. And so we're going to go through, we're going to give you microchip numbers. We're going to give you uh, eyes are open this week. Vanessa did a little bit of trim work. She trimmed their faces so their peepers show. Because if we hadn't trimmed them, the hair was up over the edge of their eyes. You couldn't really see their eyes. And it's always fun to see their eyes when they first open. So let's get started. They're doing really good. Really, really, really good. Uh, we're going to dump them out on the floor this week. So they'll be on the cubicle with mom. They can run around. We're going to start them. Uh, we'll put some... Uh, puppy food, some really tiny bite that we use. Um, so these guys will be on Purina Toy Dog Food. Uh, it's a really nice, super teeny tiny bite. Uh, we suggest that you feed it completely through the first year. And we do not feed them on a schedule. These guys will be raised on a free choice feeding, which means they eat whenever they want. It's always in front of them. That way they never overeat. They never... Um, miss a meal they can eat whenever they want and it makes them it actually puts their body on the same schedule all the time you guys are just going everywhere next week we're going on the floor all right so let's start with the chocolate one so this one is the female she's the only chocolate party in the litter and she is a female it is 89.75 is her microchip and she has the cutest face she's got a really nice little blaze on her face is your nose brown yet almost her whole her nose will turn brown eyes are going to be hazel green because she's got brown nose any dog with brown nose has green or hazel eyes she's got really nice for two and almost three weeks old look at these coats they're at least i would say at least an inch to an inch and a half long already they're nice and thick they're really nice and soft she's got a little bit of markings on her back i don't see any speckling yet so she doesn't have any spots coming underneath that coat that I can see so far stippling yeah you got one little spot there's a little spot of stippling which is more brown hair right there you can see a little bit of brown hair sometimes um, they'll get a little bit of stippling if it's carried in their bloodline but she only has a little tiny bit oh kind of they kind of look like Dalmatians when they get their speckles all over them all right so we'll see what you weigh today she is 1.02 ounces. There you go, Peabody. All right, I think this is the other female. Oh, wrong guess. Okay, I got one guess left. It's this one. I am sticking to everything today with this sweatshirt. All right, I knew she was little, but I thought that one was littler. This one's littler than she is. All right, this is the female. She is 89.74. She's got really pretty markings. She's got an all black tail. She's got a cute face. She says, I got to yawn just a minute. She's got a little bit of white around her nose that will always be there. Her nose is going to be all black. Eyes will be black. They're not going to be green. So you just lucked out on that, didn't you? You didn't get the 
chocolate jean. No, you didn't. You didn't get the chocolate jean. Let's see what she weighs. Her hair is starting to get little waves in it. She's 10, 11 ounces on the button today. Okay, pumpkin, out you come. Are you licking my hands? I know. They're noisy upstairs, aren't they? So this is a male. He has really pretty markings. He's got a big black band around the middle, white collar. He's got a black and white tail. And he's got a little black spot over here on this side. And I really like his head. He's got an all, he's the only one with an almost all black head. He has a little bit of white, makes him look like a mustache right there. He's got a white mustache with an all black head. He says, I'm wiggling out of your hands. And the underneath belly on everybody is white. Nobody's got any color. I know you're panicking. All right, his microchip number is 8970. Did I do hers? I bet I did not. Okay, the little female that I did, the black and white one, is 8974. Sorry about that. It's my first day on the job. Or maybe it'll fire me. <laughs> All right, so the male is... 89.70. All right, pumpkin, up you go. One pound, 14.6. You know, the funny thing is, even at three weeks old, these guys will start getting into food already. Um, it's amazing how quickly they start to eat, and you're going to bulldoze your way in there, aren't you? So, yep, climbing in there. I'm moving her now, okay? I'm moving you. You're going to have to get out of there. You guys are all this way. Let's see. Let's take you two. Go this way. I'll mash you. Just a minute. They still like to be swaddled. So if I can hold them together, they'll go back to sleep. It says, nope, we're going to turn around. I bet you they turn around. All right. This male is 89.72. He's got the most spotted color of the whole bunch. He's got lots of speckles. Not speckles, but stripes and spots. He's got really nice markings. His blaze goes all the way back to his collar. He's got a really pretty blaze. And again, black nose, black eyes. No pretty brown or green eyes, are they? No, his little nose has got two little tiny white spots right on the corner yet to turn. Then that'll all turn black here in the next probably week to 10 days. All right, Munchkin, let's see what you weigh. Here's a good picture of his back. One pound, 1.2. All right, so that'll give you an idea how they're doing. Um, I'm anxious to start him on food this week. It'll give Winnie a break. She, I mean, when you figure these are close to mom's weight, they're getting there. It won't be long and they're gonna weigh as much as mom does. So it takes a lot for her to feed them. And so we like to get them started as early as we can, but we don't start, I don't start any of my dogs on soft food. They'll go right on little teeny tiny kibble that they're able to eat at this age. And uh, it makes it really nice that we don't have to worry about big pieces and choking and that type thing. So, and I'm not a fan of canned dog food. I mean, it has its, it has its places in an emergency, but for puppies, no, I don't feed anybody canned food that doesn't have to have it because of an issue. And then it's not given very long. So I hope you've enjoyed their videos. Um, if you, check out the website. Um, these guys are all shown on there and the website address is below this video if you're seeing this on YouTube. And I hope you have a great rest of your week and a really pretty day is coming tomorrow. So hope you have a great day tomorrow and we'll talk to you later.